So I came driving out to the property this morning to come work on the usual stuff cutting wood. And it looks like they're doing some dirt work on the road, which is exciting. So the question remains, how far up are they doing dirt work? Now this road is both a county road and it's also a federal, I don't know what you call it, because it's a forest service road because this road leads all the way up to the top of, uh, of the, uh, at the very top of this road there's some forest service. So this is, I'll tell you what, this is, uh, I hope like heck they're working this road all the way to the very top. Uh, there's one side of me that is really happy right now, there's another side of me that worries because the better this road is, the more traffic is going to be on this road. But uh, anyway, I'll keep I'll, I'll keep you up to date on this. I just passed the grader, and it looks like he's working it all the way to the top. Five thousand five hundred feet in elevation is my bet. We're gonna be bring the GPS up here in a couple days and uh, get the exact elevation. But man, my body's screaming at me right now. That fire's going good. I'm trying to work uh, closest to this to the fire and work away from it. Um, I've told myself I'm not firing a chainsaw up until the well, only way I'm firing a chainsaw up is if I uh, if I uh, am trying to cut these up into manageable pieces. But I'm not falling any more trees. I'm not doing nothing. Come here, Ruger. Come here, boy. Hey, what are you doing? You've been playing in the water. And uh, I'm gonna run down and dip my head in the in the creek. Um, hope I don't go into shock. Um, I would guess it's probably the warmest day of the year so far today, which would put us in probably the high 60s, uh, but I'm sweating my, you know what, off. Uh, working around that fire, that's a hot fire, I'll tell you that much. Um, but, you know, if I don't keep doing something, nothing's ever gonna get done. Um, I have friends in town volunteering to come up here and uh, and help, which uh, I think is the great part about these small communities. People are willing to do that. But I don't want anybody else falling trees um, just just to make sure that certain trees don't get, get cut down that I likely would have saved. So what I think I'll do is after I get this whole side um, cleared out, I think I'm gonna just go and start falling trees like crazy on this side and then uh, then do a barbecue or something up here and invite a bunch of guys to come and uh, help out maybe maybe make a, uh, a sleepover out of it or something like that um, I've already had somebody ask if, if I would let the church uh, or not, not necessarily the church some guys that go to the church come up here for fathers and sons outings and things like that so Anyway.
Go one. 